So good morning folks. Uh, it's about, what time is it? It's about 10 past 6 in the morning I suppose. Yeah. And myself and Barney are just about to start our uh, day sack challenge. We've got Chris and John coming out a little bit later. So um, we're just headed our way up to a, a little spot to uh, commence our sort of challenge. I mean, we're making it, we, it sounds like we're doing something really fucking serious, doesn't it? No, but it ain't, it's just like really easy. It's, it's, <laughs> it's just a piece, we're just having a bit of fun, like, you know, just going a bit more lightweight than what we normally do, I suppose. So uh, I've got the, um, anyway, I've got my uh, Fell Raven Steuben. And Barney's using, uh, he walks past pack. me, he's got the old, uh, Northern Ireland Patrol Pack. So I don't know if that's going to pick it up too much in the camera because I've got all my head torch because obviously it's still bleeding dark here. So yeah, we'll see how it goes. So uh, we'll catch up with you later. <laughs> I've only been to this spot once in the daylight. So I'm kind of relying on Barney right now just to negate us in. I can't get into the packet. <laughs> Can you just push it out like a tablet? Nah, it's quite strong actually. That's a bit embarrassing. Alright, I managed to get it out of there, but I had to use my knife. Well done, Des. I oh, know. <laughs> Bless. Bless his cottons. Nope. These are good, aren't they? Use them. Oh, they're wicked. Paul, give us some of that. Give us some. Yeah. yeah, I've got to admit, for sort of little, you know, not cheating, are you? Just it's wet and taking advantage of the situation. It's in my pocket whilst I struggle. Yeah, go on, mate. Yeah, they burn quite well.
So as you can see folks got me uh the bivy bag, got me uh the mat there, I've got a nice cushion, I do like a pillow, uh got a fleece liner inside my thin sleeping bag. So uh acid test will be tonight I suppose. It's supposed to be going down to minus two in it. Like that, minus one, minus two tonight, but you know, no worries. There's the other two boys walking in now, uh, John and Chris. You see them just coming through the uh, trees there. You alright mate? You alright boys? Uh, just coming in now. Uh, not much. Nano, like nano seconds perhaps. But... Only a bit <laughs> Oh mate, isn't it? Yeah, he's fine with his teaching, so we get to about two o'clock. Boom, yeah, just drop out. Right. Going out of date here. Yeah. Yeah. I've had them before, so 2016. Alright. That'd be fine, mate. Someone, I'm surprised at what dog's out of date. What dog's mm. out of date? What parish is? Is it in that out of date, or is it just before that? No, no. Yeah, out of date. Yeah, yeah. I've got loads of stuff like the 14th. I've got stuff in the 90s. Really? Yeah. I had a shit, I had some cheese reserves that were out of date in like the 70s. Yeah, that's basically right. Yeah. Oh, this thing. So finding more stuff you buy nowadays from like the shops, it doesn't last really much longer than our feet. Am I really eating rice or? Yeah, not really. I've had them before, they're nice. Yeah, they're fine, they're not. Yeah. Food enough. Food are good. Yeah. Good man size food. Yeah. 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 Doing. The little constricts are not in there. Let's put the old uh, on in here. It's probably a bit low actually. That'll do. Put enough. 
another notch in there, Des. Yeah, I'll need to put another notch in the bottom, don't I? Yeah. Just to lift it up a bit more. Things just come up, but yeah, it does do that screen. It's easier to stand for. Alright. <laughs> but yeah, they do. So it'd be even worth our going over and asking for that, wouldn't it? Mm. Right, let's have a look then. Right, doesn't it? Nice colour. Mm. Uh, that bit of cinnamon and the raisins. Oh, that still looks a bit doughy in the middle, doesn't it? Well, we'll see. It'll be alright. It is a little bit. Better than yours. Uh, I'm not sure about that. <laughs> I think mine was much better. Still a bit doughy in the middle, I think. Yeah, I'll show you. You're going to let us taste it then? Like I'd let you taste mine? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. The smells are amazing. Look at that. Oh. It's got cinnamon and raisins in it now. Can't beat a bit of cinnamon. Yeah, it's alright. Come on, mate. Yeah, I'll try. Right, that'll be there. Yeah, hold yeah, it. Yeah, go for it, go for it. So, what, what, what's this, mate? What's, what's it sat on? Just a bit of. It's a bit of sycamore. I was going to carve a sort of a bowly plate. But I was um, oh getting on my nerves. It's really so good. That'll do. That'll do, wouldn't it? Just yeah. to it put on. It's come out alright, that. It's actually it's only that bit that's doughy. The yeah. other bit is alright. Just a knob end, isn't it? Just that bit on the end there. You gave me the dodgy bit then. <laughs> oh, thanks a lot. Don't trust not. That's alright. That would be nice if you had some maple syrup or something. Ketchup. Ketchup. There's a field maple <laughs> over there. I'm just going to tap some. Yeah, go and tap some now. Oh, that's lovely, especially with that brown sugar. Mmm. There's a wild cherry down there as well. There you are? Mmm, good one. There are, bum. There's a cherry down there. What? Wild cherry. Cherry. Yeah, so I've been out collect some clematis and uh, I'm going to call myself a little clematis basket, basket this afternoon, so uh, we'll see how it goes with that. Yeah, we've gone a bit cannibalistic at the moment and we've put Chris into, a, into some bake for we're going to eat him later. <laughs> that is mad, isn't it? But so, 30 minutes of gas mark 4. Yeah. <laughs> but it packed, like when it's actually, when you buy it brand new though, it's actually vacuumed down yeah, to nothing. Yeah, it's like, like the old VHS cassette tape. Oh yeah. But I'm going to try it in anger tonight properly, so when I'm in the mountains, if I do find myself in the shit, I can always... Yeah, blizzard pack. Yeah, yeah, it's getting yeah. Getting out of the field. Quite thick, isn't it? Yeah, you feel the heat from it as well. Yeah, you yeah. get in, you can feel it. You can see it's Malar, obviously, like what Moore says, you don't actually have it wrapped on no, you. No, you just want it to touch almost so, a little bit of airflow yeah. through it, don't you? Yeah, so like climbing that tonight. Yeah, that's my rig tonight. Wow. And you've got your Zed mat. And my Zed mat, and so yeah, I might just go for it cold turkey and just lay in it as it is, just to give it a proper, proper because in. I don't know. need to lay it from the ground, though, would it? A little bit. Get a bit cold. Probably will get a bit of cold, but... Oh, I'll yeah. Just... Oh, of course it will. Yeah. Right. Like good craft either, isn't it? It's quite... It's so flexible, this stuff. Looking really good, mate. It's not looking too bad, is it? No, it's looking alright. It's got to go underneath. That last bit I'll just poke in now. So what have you done? Have you just done the base? Hey? Just done the base now, have you? I'm always doing the base, yeah, and then what I'll do is I'll 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 bend the uh, stems up a bit. I mean I'm not making a proper basket, I'm just making more of a a bowl, I oh, suppose. Yeah, I ain't taking it home though. Last time I took one home, I just didn't like it. Okay, yeah, here's the start of it then. It's looking good, then. Yeah, it's Not looking, looking bad, really, is it? It's actually, I mean, it's like, yeah, it's good. Cheers, mate. Mm. Motherfucker. <laughs> There's the sort of start of it. Now, a bit, a bit better. Mate, that's uh, really good. It's alright, I suppose. It'd do the job, wouldn't it? Yeah. You click some eggs in that. What? You're going to put a handle on I might it. do, yeah, because I'm only keeping it small. I mean, I'm not going, um, Just tie the top, I'm not going to, uh, it's like an Easter bonnet. 
Yeah. It's just the only get with it is the starting off, you know what I mean? Once you get started, it's, Come it's you pretty hot. Pardon? You like the geezer, you remember the, what was the, you remember Big Trouble in Little China? Yeah. <laughs> Samurai. Like, be like them, wouldn't it? Yeah, just sort of follow it in and out. So where did you learn this skill then? You know what, I've always had a bit of a thing for basketry. I like right. that. I went to the gathering one year and there was a Doris there. I mean, all right. She was an attractive lady, but that's regardless <laughs> of that. It doesn't matter. But I actually went, oh, seriously, I was the only bloke in the class. It was all women. It was all women. I sat there, I was like, oh, but they were great, you know. And I just got, I just, I made a couple of hazel, I made a couple of baskets from hazel. And I've always had a bit of a thing for, for you know, a bit of basketry making. But then I like, I think what's simpler is this method, is to coil it, like just coiling stuff. Yeah. Because it's just less, oh, I, initially the bit just put, you know, binding them together and that's a bit of a git. But um, especially using this clematis, it's so flexible. Well, just watching you do that, mate, it, look, it looks, you know, looks like good fun, to be fair. It's so flexible. I mean, I'm yeah. down there, you know, when I went to get yeah. the water, and I was pulling the ones, that, like, even those thinner ones, and it was, where it amazes me how it climbs up so high. Yeah. And it was, like, right up, and I was pulling on that, and it was bringing over the branches, and it wouldn't snap. I had to sort of reach up as high as I could, and then just sort of, you know, nip it off with the knife. Yeah. But, um, yeah, it's really, it's really pliable stuff. It really is, you know. Yeah, no time at all that's been made, that's, that's brilliant. Isn't it? Yeah. I mean, well impressed. Not fancy, is it? But I mean, it's... Yeah, but it looks good, mate. You know, People would buy that in the shop. They probably <laughs> wouldn't, they'd put their plants yeah, in there. Yeah, that's it, hang it off. I wish I could wear it as a hat. Big trouble in Little China. There you go. Oh, a bit like the Predator. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Hello? Come here. <laughs> yeah, so, um... Nice oh, that's easy that's one to awesome. do, Yeah. Happy days, mate. Well done. Thank you. All right, there it is, folks. A little basket made out of clematis. Didn't keep a handle on it. I did actually cut them off a little bit skew with, but um, kind of get the picture. Nice and flexible materials to use. And uh, got a nice basket there to put some fruit in or whatever, or if I wish to wear it as a hat <laughs> and reenact sort of big trouble in Little China. Yeah, mate, awesome. I'm well impressed. Great, folks. All right, excellent. Happy day. Look at that. That is pucker. Nice one, Des. A bit tidying up, but yeah, it's alright. Cheers, mate. It doesn't actually burn too bad with this stuff. Well, I've got that fat cotton in there. Yeah. Season. I've got the run. Colour what? Colour what? Colour what? Colour what? Colour what? Colour what? Colour what?
Right folks, so there it is. We've done our, uh, our day set challenge. It's quite cold last night. It, it was definitely obviously minus, wasn't it? But minus oh, yeah. one or two or something like that. But we, uh, it was a good night though. Um, I've done a podcast for this one. So you've got myself, Barney, Chris and John on there. If you haven't had a listen to it yet, or if you don't know, check the link out in the description. And uh, yeah, that's it folks. I'll be having a little few follow-up videos of like Kit Our Turk and, and things like that. All right, so again, check out the description and I'll do a playlist, probably call it Des Muck or something like that. All right, so uh, Des Cat is signing out and I'll see you on the flip side. I'll show you, do it again.